going to be showing you some summer hairstyles for a medium length hair. If you're new to our channel, hello, my name is Autumn, and my sister Amber couldn't be here today, but I'm really glad you came across our channel. If you'd like to see more videos of us in the future, hit the subscribe button right here. So, let's get into the video. The first hairstyle is sort of a 90s inspired look that seems to be coming back recently, and it's really simple to do. So, all you have to do is take a section of hair from one side and pull it straight back and pin it there. For a better effect, I'd suggest using hairspray or gel to make it look really slick. For the next style, you're going to take the front section of your hair and pull it all the way back. Then push it slightly forward to give it a little effect of a pop, and then clip it there. The third style is the most simplistic because it's just a little accent to the hair and it's not really a huge hairstyle. So the way to do it is to take a very small piece of hair and loop it around your finger. Then you have to slide the end through the hole and pull it through. It's basically like making a knot and you can do as many of these as you want for little accents. Here is a close up version of how to do the loop just so it would seem a little easier. The next hairstyle is a great one for sports or outside activities in the summer because it protects your hair from the heat but it also gets it out of your face. So you're going to start by doing French twist on your bangs, and if you don't know how to do a French twist, it's basically twisting your hair around but slowly adding in pieces as you go along. Do that all the way around your head and finish it off with a nice three strand braid. <laughs> For the next hairstyle, you'll need a pencil. These are really fun to do, but they take a little bit of practice. First, take all of your hair and twist it into the position you normally would for a regular bun. Then stick the pencil in from the bottom and turn it toward your scalp until the pointy part of the pencil is face down again. Then push it down to around the nape of your neck. Also, if you're like me and you like your buns a little more messy, then you can basically just mess it up and style it the way you like once the pencil's in. <laughs> For the last hairstyle, start off by taking three small sections of your hair from one side of your head. Do a French braid all the way down until you get to the ends of your hair. To do a French braid, you just do a regular braid and similar to the French twist, just add in pieces as you go. Once you've done that all the way down, you put the braid under the rest of your hair so that you can basically just hide the ends and then pull the rest of your hair over it so that it looks really cool and then you're done.